Welcome back to day seven of the seven nights of sleep. We tend to overcomplicate our lives and minds with explanations and reasons. We believe that in order to understand something, we need to define it. This need to define everything creates a rigid thinking system making it impossible to truly turn off, relax and find inner peace within. Life and everything that it encompasses can't always be explained. It is not a riddle that can be solved intellectually. The desire to get our life in order is what drives us to take action. We live in a world that is strongly driven by ambition. And as a result, many of us have evolved into stressed out overachievers. We believe in the hype that we must be more and have more. Therefore, we are always living in a state of striving, yet never arriving. Overvaluing the need to have more and achieve more leads to a constant struggle of wanting more. It becomes an endless pursuit of seeking more, more wealth, more power, more material things, more knowledge, more achievement, and so forth. The endless quest to understand and rationalize everything is what causes us to overthink things in an attempt to justify why things are the way they are. This creates not only busy, cluttered minds that can't turn off at night, but it is also one of the main causes of judgment towards others. To live with a calm mind and content heart, we must give up the need to stop labeling and defining everything in our life. When we live within a state of needing to be in total control of our lives, by being able to understand and define everything that happens to us, we fill our headspace with complexities such as worry, judgment, anger and so forth. And it is this very state of mind that prevents sleep at night and one which can cause depression, stress and anxiety. By trying to define the world or understand why people do what they do, you will never come to understand the full truth for you will only ever see fragments which have been defined by your own experience and perspective of the outer world. When we learn to become more flexible by just being and allowing, we then give up our need to always be in control of life. Surrendering, allowing and practicing acceptance is the key to letting go of control, allowing us to find inner peace and calm within. Surrendering isn't about not trying at all. It's not about becoming lazy, trying for nothing or giving up. Rather, 
It is about learning how to release our tight grip on the need for perfect outcomes and the need to understand everything. When you feel internally frenzied and have a strong desire to act, choose to stay quiet and sit with the emotions. After the storm within has calmed, allow yourself to be guided by the quiet and gentle voice within. You will recognize the internal voice because it will feel slow, melodious and at peace rather than frenzied, reactive and anxious. In today's practice, we are going to take a journey into the world of surrender and trust. The goal is to transform fear and disappointment into trust and hope by allowing ourselves to let go of our need to control and instead choose to surrender to the love and wisdom of the universe. Let's start today's practice by finding a comfortable position. Rest your hands softly by your side or in your lap. Feel yourself relaxing allowing your body to sink deeper and deeper into the ground below you. Take a few slow, full deep breaths in, inviting the mind and body to relax. Taking a deep breath in, sending the breath all the way to your belly, holding the breath for a few seconds and then releasing the breath. Focus on your breath for a moment. Breathing in and holding. And then breathing out and releasing any stress or tension. Allow your breath to return to its soft, natural rhythm. Feel your body rise and fall with each breath. As we journey into this meditation together, take a moment to name something that has shifted in your life. Something that makes you feel a little uncertain, nervous or sad for the future. It may be the loss of a loved one, loss of a job, financial worries, the stress of getting everything done throughout the day, and so forth. As you breathe, 
remind yourself that you can't control everything. Past this fear and uncertainty lies peace. We are going to journey together into a place of surrender and serenity. As we go on this journey, you may encounter things that feel uncomfortable. Stay with your breath. Let your breath anchor you. You are safe within the breath. Allow your muscles to relax, knowing you are safe. Shift your attention from the breath to the top of your head and face. Scan this area. Notice any tightness or tension in your forehead, temples, eyes and jaw. If you feel any tension, breathe deeply into that area, allowing it to soften, to let go and surrender. Breathe in, trust in the process. Feel the peace. As you exhale, gently release tension, pain, stress and fear. Your mind is opening surrendering. It is safe. It is free. It is letting go. Move your attention to your neck and shoulders. This is an area that we often hold stress or emotions in. See if you notice any tightness. Direct your breath into this area. As you breathe out, Release any tightness in the body. Release your need to control the events of your life. You cannot control life. You can only control how you choose to react to life. Trust that something greater exists within the universe. Something that brings divine order to all. An energy of love and creation. Breathe in its love. 
breathing at safety. Breathe in its soft, gentle guidance. Bring your awareness to your arms, feeling any sensations within the arms. Are they cold? tingly, numb, heavy. You are not judging or labelling the sensation. You are simply noticing the sensation. Scan the length of your arms, wrists, palms and fingers. Breathe deeply into this area, allowing it to soften, allowing all tension and fear to melt away. It is only when we soften and allow, allowing our mind and body to simply flow like water, that we create space within for acceptance and love to grow. Shift your focus to your upper and lower back. Scan the entire back, starting from the top. Move slowly down the back, vertebrae by vertebrae. Noticing any discomfort. If discomfort arises, simply breathe deeply into the area, softening it, creating space for discomfort to be released. Let go. And allow yourself to float free into the stars of the universe. Trusting you are safe, nurtured and supported from the universe. Bring your attention around to your chest and belly. Direct the breath into these areas. Feeling them rise and fall. Notice what's here. Many ancient cultures 
believe that we choose our experiences before beginning our life on earth. Experiences that will expand our soul, teaching us more wisdom, compassion, open-heartedness and self-awareness. What if your toughest moments have come to you because someone or something selected them for you, knowing you would not be defeated by them? Scan your hips glutes and pelvic region. Imagine yourself feeling heavy, sinking deeper and deeper into relaxation. Trust that there is meaning in what you are experiencing right now. Trust that all that happens to you comes to you for a reason. Even if you cannot understand the reason in this moment. Trust that there is a purpose behind all your pain, uncertainty and fear. Trust that the universe is with you on your journey, even through your darkest hours. Sweep your awareness to your legs, scanning from the thighs down to the knees and calves. Just soften and allow. Allow yourself to release your need to understand or control. Release your attachment to people, things and thoughts. Allow yourself to float into the safe arms of the universal light. A place that is more beautiful than you can ever imagine. A place that will fill you with inner peace, stillness, and calm, a place that will remind you of the beauty and perfection of the unknown, a place that will remind you that there is a divine order to all, even if our human mind cannot yet see it. Drop your awareness into your feet and toes, feeling yourself 
fully present to all sensations. Allow the breath to fill your entire body. Drinking in the breath and on the exhale, relaxing and expanding a little deeper. As you breathe in, let go and open yourself up to new possibilities. Know that while it may feel terrifying, it is also deeply freeing. Surrender your need to control and understand. Allow yourself to float into the light, into that place where the universe meets you. Reconnecting with your breath. On the inhale, breathe in peace and let go of control. Breathe in new possibilities. Release old attachments. Breathe in a new way of being, a more softer and trusting being. Let go and surrender to all the fear, pain, anxiety, stress. Things may not always turn out how you plan, but know with certainty that you are always taken to where you need to go. You may not always find success as mainstream culture views success, but trust that you have found personal growth, knowledge, self-empowerment and a more open heart and mind for just trying. And at times, there may be situations that just require patience and the right timing. But trust that the great adventure will always seek you out. And when life isn't working out and you're trying to fumble and navigate through all the disasters. Stay strong by allowing yourself to loosen your grip on control and the need to achieve the perfect outcome. Anchor yourself within your breath and continue to just put one foot in front of another. Free yourself 
by choosing to breathe, surrender and allow. Having full trust that everything is in perfect divine order. Free yourself by no longer rowing upstream. Instead, let the current take you where it wants you to go. As one door closes, another door opens. Be open to all possibilities. Sometimes the universe delivers you something much bigger than you could ever have dreamed of. And the only thing that is required from you is to simply stop living from a place of endless wanting and move into a place of constant acceptance and trust. It's not what happens to you that matters. It's how you respond to what happens to you. When disappointment and sadness come knocking at your door, invite it in and know that its higher purpose is to open your mind expand your heart and deepen your soul's awareness. Open yourself up to vulnerability, gentleness, trust and acceptance. For these are your tools to navigate through those times of pain, uncertainty and fear. Truth is, bad things happen to everyone. Don't let the bad disempower you, harden you or bring you down. There is a time for grief, sadness and anger. But there also is a point where you need to let it go in order to keep moving forward. It is about learning to make peace with what is. With grace, learn to let go of all that is not meant for you. Trusting that what is meant for you will come your way. And just maybe, at the end of the day, this journey is not so much about becoming anything. Maybe it's about unbecoming everything that's not really you. So that you can then become who you were always meant to be. Reconnect with your breath. Bring a gentle awareness to the room around you. Wiggle your fingers and toes. And in your own time, open your eyes.
Thank you for joining me for day seven of the seven days of sleep. I will reconnect again with you tomorrow as we talk about mindfulness. Until then, sleep well and sweet dreams.